Welcome to the Citizens Concert Band's final performance for the 2017 summer concert season. If you or someone you know is interested in joining our band, there's a link on our website at citizensconcertband.org to put you in touch with our conductor Jeremy Berger and assistant conductor Jennifer McConnell. Tonight we are sponsored by the City of St. Albans. Our director, Jeremy Berger, invites you to relax and enjoy the evening as the band plays some of their requested favorites. We started out with a trip down Broadway with a medley entitled, Marching Down Broadway. Herb Alpert's discovery of recording a second trumpet part just slightly off key from the lead proved to be one of the most lucrative and influential flukes in music history. Alpert was playing around with overdubbing a tune called Twinkle Star. Then, while visiting in Tijuana, Mexico, he happened to hear a mariachi band. Alpert adopted the trumpet style to his tune and mixed in crowd cheers and other noises to suggest a bullfight and renamed the tune The Lonely Bull. That was his first big hit and is included here in this medley, one of the band's favorites, called Tijuana Brass in Concert.
This next piece is a march dedicated to the 7th Ward Military Band of Omaha, Nebraska. Written by O.R. Far Farrar in 1895, this is Bombasto. George and Ira Gershwin will forever be remembered as the songwriting team whose pieces were synonymous with the sounds and styles of the jazz age. While the brothers, while the brothers did have individual careers, their collaborations were almost ex exclusively with each other, composing over two dozen scores for Broadway and Hollywood. They helped raise popular musical theater to a new level of sophistication. Please welcome our talented vocalist, Claire Hungerford, to vocalize one of their famous numbers, Someone to Watch Over Me.
there's a somebody I'm longing to see. I hope that he turns out to be someone who watch over me. I'm a little lamb who's lost in the wood. I know I could always be good to one who Ginger Rogers first performed Embraceable You in the 1930s musical Girl Crazy. Decades later, Rogers spontaneously changed the lyrics during a 1983 rehearsal for the Tony Awards. As singer Michael Feinstein recalls, she sang, Don't be a naughty papa, come to baby, come to baby do. The producers shouted at her, No, you're singing the wrong words. She said, don't tell me what's correct. I introduced this song. Claire will now sing for you, Embraceable You.
me my sweet embraceable you embrace me you irreplaceable you just one look at you my heart grew tip seeing me you and you alone bring out the chip seeing me I love all the many charms about you above all I want my arms about you don't be a naughty baby come to papa come to papa do my sweet embrace you Thank you, Claire. The first recording of American Patrol was a two-minute Edison cylinder in 1903, and it retained popularity during both world wars. In the beginning of American Patrol, the music is very, very soft, which conveys the patrol in the far distance. As the patrol nears, the music gets louder until the patrol passes and the music grows much louder. Then the music gradually diminishes as the patrol passes into the distance. American Patrol.
This 1978 song takes place at a famous nightclub in New York City named after a district in Rio de Janeiro and earned Barry Manilow a Grammy Award. This is Barry Manilow's mega hit Copacabana featuring Dave Duprat on drums and our whole lower brass section. Copacabana.
West Side Story is a musical with music by Leonard Bernstein and lyrics by Stephen Sondheim. The musical's plot is based on William Shakespeare's Romeo and Juliet. Here's one of many famous numbers from that musical, Somewhere, from West Side Story.
Jamie Texador named the original orchestral version of this piece for a girl named Amparita Roca, who lived in Madrid, Spain. This band arrangement by Aubrey Winter captures the spirit and drive of the original and has become a standard part of concert band repertoire. Hang on as we play the fast-moving Spanish, mar Spanish march, Amparita Roca. Claire Hungerford is going to join us once again for our next number that young and old, everybody knows. Here is Claire to sing Over the Rainbow from The Wizard of Oz.
once in a lullaby Somewhere over the rainbow skies are blue and the dreams that you dare to dream really do come true someday i'll wish upon a star and wake up where the clouds are far behind me where troubles melt like lemon drops away above the chimney tops that's where Somewhere over that rainbow, bluebirds fly, birds fly over that rainbow, why then oh why can't I? I would like to note that unfortunately, this will be Claire's final performance with the Citizens Concert Band. As many have found, especially in an all-volunteer town band, sometimes the job commitments and other factors that touch our very busy lives just don't jive forever. We will miss Claire and her beautiful voice, but we wish her well and thank her profusely for singing with us these past seven years. Thank you, Claire. We do have one other band number after the vocal, this vocal piece, and then Claire will join us for the Star Spangled Banner. But for now, Claire is going to collaborate with the famous Gershwin brothers in this number, first introduced by Fred Astaire in the 1937 film, Shall We Dance? Claire will sing, They Can't Take That Away From Me.
The way you wear your hat The way you sing a key The memory of all that No, no, they can't take that away from me The way your smile just beams The way you sing a key the way you haunt my dreams No, no, they can't take that away from me We may never, never meet again On that bumpy road to love Still I'll always, always keep that memory of The way you hold your knife the way we dance till three The way you change my life No, no, they can't take that away from me No, they can't take that away from me Be on the lookout for information related to a Christmas concert this year. We normally play the first Sunday after Thanksgiving, but nothing is set in stone yet for date, time, or venue. Keep an eye out on our website at citizensconcertband.org for upcoming details. And now, on behalf of our director, Jeremy Berger, assistant director, Jennifer McConnell, and all of us in the Citizens Concert Band, we'd like to thank you for the great times we had sharing our music with you and for your support this summer. It has been a long-standing tradition to end our final summer concert with a march entitled Totem Pole by Eric Osterling, who uses a, mirror, a musical pyramid effect. Notice how one part comes in, then another, and another, until the piece builds to a dynamic finish. Totem Pole. <laughs> 